Ooh, that's a hard drink. Hey guys, this is my review for A Star Is Born, and I just wanted to show this off. I found this at Hot Topic. Yes, I feel dirty saying that, but that's a pretty cool mug. It is tiny. I know I'm very late for this review, but I waited to see this with uh, my girlfriend, and I really did enjoy this movie. It is a very hard-hitting film. It's not exactly one you're gonna wanna watch. You will definitely wanna listen to the music. The soundtrack is actually pretty good. It has a good blend of this kind of rock, a little bit of country, but not so much that you're gonna wanna throw up. And also the pop sort of ideology of what Lady Gaga's music is known for. But it's a very hard-hitting film about two lovers who are so entrenched with each other as well as in music and their passion burns bright, but at the same time, their own want for success and just joy is overshadowed by addictions and personal demons. And Bradley Cooper does a pretty good job for a first time director. I'll give him that, he does it pretty well. And considering apparently he didn't, he had knowledge of playing and singing, but he went through a lot of training and apparently he was hanging out with Willie Nelson's son, Luke Nelson, like every other day for a year, learning how to play guitar. The chemistry between the two is so freaking good. Lady Gaga and Bradley are so good with each other. Every scene they are in melds very well, and they play off of each other fantastically. It's the diving into the addiction side. I have talked with a few people who are former alcoholics and they said this film nails it down and it really takes you into the depravity and just the the demons the personal kind of problems that addicts deal with and the film's ending is very hard it's a very hard-hitting film at the end but I feel that it leaves some questions up to yourself as to kind of the choices that the characters make and why would they do those sort of things and what do they think the outcome of those are? There's a bit of jumps here and there, but there's these little moments that intertwine through it. It's like watching a long music video, but not a shit one. And the story is well-centered. And I think it's a pretty darn good film. It's one of the better ones of the year for sure. It's definitely blew away my expectations. I didn't even realize that this was a remake until I looked into it. It's the fourth, I believe, in the history of the films. I honestly was very impressed with this film. It's a hard film, it's not one you'd want to re-watch all the time, but the soundtrack is very good. Lady Gaga gives a performance that I was pretty pretty impressed with. I don't know if it's going to win any award, but I definitely know that Shallow is going to be in the running for best song. Either Shallow or I'll Never Love Again, one of those two. I'm going to give A Star Is Born a 6 out of 7. I really enjoyed this film. I think it's a very good personal film, and I was not expecting this from Bradley Cooper, so... I thought that was pretty cool. Anyways guys, hope you enjoyed this review. If you did, leave a like, and if you're interested in more, maybe subscribe. Otherwise, that's all from me. See you guys next time.